Hey, welcome to my channel. Today's message is you are royalty. Now, before I get into the message, you know, I gotta let you know that this message may resonate with you or it may not and that's okay because every message may not be for you but this message is for somebody so take what resonates and leave what does not all right now let's get into the message so today's channel message spirit says you are royalty why because you have a royal heart See, many people got it twisted. It's not a crown that makes you royalty. It's not about having a high status in life that makes you royalty. It's not about how much money you got that makes you royalty. And it's also not about coming from a wealthy family that makes you royalty or having a lot of expensive and shiny things. Spirit is saying your material or your worldly possessions do not make you royalty. The true essence of royalty lies within the heart of those who have kindness, compassion, and empathy. Therefore, a royal heart it is a heart full of God's grace. And when our heart abounds in grace, we will live more in the spirit realm than in the flesh mentality so whoever i'm speaking to god says you are royalty it's what's in you and not what's on you you're someone who is in the world but not of the world meaning you don't allow your flesh to control you you're someone who listens to your intuition because your heart is in alignment with the most high god therefore you are forever royalty. It is embedded in your DNA. All right. So next, let's get into these cards, which confirms the message. All right. The first card over here is the star card. And it says inspiration, fulfillment, and faith. Now with the star card i feel like this represents you someone with compassion who has a strong faith and a connection to source you may also be a star seed next is the dreamer card also known as the fool card and it says beginning believing and protected I feel like the food card represents you again being someone who has a strong faith. You're also someone who listens to your intuition or you're, or you're someone who follows your dreams. And you're also someone who is free from the world limitations. Next is the Queen of Earth, also known as the Queen of Pentacles. And it says gracious, practical, and capable. Now with the Queen of Pentacles, I feel like you're someone who is very grounded. Like I said, you are in the world, but you're not of the world. There's a balance there. You're not too caught up with earthly matters because you're someone who is well-rounded is what I'm getting. Last but not least over here is the lover's card. So I feel like you're someone who makes choices from the heart, but you also use logic as well because you are also someone who has balanced out both your feminine and your masculine energies within. Therefore, you walk in love and you walk in unity. All right. I thank you so much for your time. Until next time.